In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to insert citations as you write in Microsoft Word as well as Google Documents using Zotero. The process is relatively the same for both writing programs. As you are writing, it's ideal to insert your citations as you are making the reference, aka cite as you write. So you don't have to go back and try to remember where you need to insert the citations when you are finished writing your work. Before you start writing, make sure Zotero is open. The Zotero software is open on your device so it can communicate to your writing program. When you want to enter a citation, which I'm going to do here at, my end of this, at the end of my sentence, um, for the first time you will actually click on Zotero and then click Add Citation. Once per document, it'll prompt you to choose a citation style. So Zotero is asking me, out of all the citation styles here, uh, which one do you want? I'm, for the sake of this video, I'm going to use APA, the most recent edition, and click OK. Next, a little red bar will pop up, and this is how you will search and select which citation you want to add to your reference or to the end of your text here. So um, there's a couple options on how to do this. You can do a keyword search by author's last name. I'm sure I have lots of Smith. <laughs> so here I can choose um, which article I'm actually citing and I can just select and hit enter um, and let's say I need to write another I'm writing another sentence and I have to do another citation. I click Add Citation. Uh, the other option, if you don't want to do a keyword search for author or title, this and that, um, you can actually click on the Z and go to Classic View and it'll just show you a mini version of your Zotero library. So I might remember that the article I am citing is in my public health folder and I'm actually citing let's say this article here uh, this also gives you some functionality if you want to do multiple sources in one citation so in that case I can say I'm actually citing so citing this one here in the same idea or in the same sentence so I hit OK and I'll add both authors there in order as I'd like to have them I'm going to do one other citation, uh, let's actually go to Classic View so I can use the same folder here. And let's say I want to select this, according to APA, if you do a specific quote or something along those lines, you have to put the page number, paragraph number. So here allows me to put book chapter, note, etc. if you need that functionality based on your citing style preferences. So let's say on page six, I'm doing the direct quote. So here I have my for references, once you are done writing your paper, all you have to do is click on Add Bibliography, and then based on those in-text citations, you have your reference list ready to roll. In Google Docs, it's the exact same, same setup. I click on Zotero. I add a citation. Um, it'll make sure I am logged in online. Yes, I want APA. So again, it's prompting me to make that selection for my citation style. That little red bar pops up. I search. Well, let's do a different search. Let's say nursing. Sure, information literacy in nursing. And I click, I click on my reference. I hit enter. And I go through the exact same process when I'm done. Here's add bibliography.